a YouTuber who commented on my second ever made YouTube video who wanted to see a certain product. And I encourage this behavior for everybody who sees this. I'm down, I'm a content cruncher I'm about it. So thank you to Richard Scotts of the YouTube world. Um, I have purchased off of Wish, actually I, I did buy two, a endoscope. What's an endoscope? Spam. It's not spam, but it's like, it's this spam. You know what I'm saying? Um, it is a camera. It is a very tiny camera that is used to put inside of either a human orifice, for example, up your nose, down your throat, check your tonsils, or when you become like 50 dudes, you know where that one goes. Essentially, it's a small camera on a cord that's got the cable inside of it that attaches to this specifically was asked by the viewer to connect into USB or uh, Android. Here's the here's the stitch. Here's the kicker. Okay, and I'm sorry to report this, and it was really difficult. It's why this video took so long. There is no such thing that I can find that is a universal endoscope that works for iPhones or iOS adapters or Macs. So I have an iPhone. This is shot on an iPhone X. Now, since it does have a adapter for Android, I thought maybe I could just use one of these awesome creations. It's a Android to iOS adapter. I just changes all over. Didn't work. Sorry. Maybe yours will. Mine didn't. So I don't know what to tell you. So, like I said, we're getting started on this. It's actually a fairly product, fairly, fairly product. It's a fairly desired product on Wish, I've noticed. There's probably a thousand different sellers, okay? I will post the information though that I purchased mine at the end of the video and as well in the pictures coming up. So, this camera is, like I said, for small, tiny spaces and they come in different lengths measured in meters. Since I was just doing some unboxing for you guys, I only got one meter and they're marked on the sides here of this box, this particular brand, which is not have a name. It's just a box. It came fairly quickly. I'm really pleased about that. Um, the one I purchased before this was much flimsier. I bought them both off Wish. One was kind of a dud. It worked just as well as this one does. But, but, okay. Here's the stitch. The set can't connect to your iPhone. So I have my handy dandy laptop with me. This is an HP Pavilion, I believe two years old. Now, when you look at the box, it's got all this good stuff front and back. It's got all the information of what is what. And on the back, it has specifications and application fields, like where you would use this. You would use it. It's also, ooh, it's a waterproof. It's underwater. If you drop jewelry down the drain or down a vent, this could be very, very useful to you. And if not one of the most useful tools you could have in recovering lost jewelry and vents and drains, this could be what makes you smile again when you get you need to retrieve items. And that's what it came with some gifts. Now, most of the endoscopes come with these gifts and they are extensions to the tool. The tool being the camera itself. The first extension we have is adorable. And it's very hard to tell what that is. So what are you playing with, Desi? What is this nonsensical item? If you look very, very carefully, there we go. There's actually a little itty bitty mirror in there. It is for seeing around corners and such. So say you got the camera straight in, you gotta look corridor to, to the left. This thing's peeping at it. Got it, got it, it's all cool. And then you have a little barrel piece. It looks like so. It's got one side that has a divot down the length of it. I'll explain to you what that's for. It's for holding your gifts. Gift numero uno. So this is actually the top. This does not go inside the round part as I so assumed. The little divot I just mentioned is for this weird little crookedy shape. That goes inside said divot. And then you slip these over your endoscope. Now. What does it do? What does this do? Well, I will show you. Because it just so happens that there's another tool that they give you. Get things. This one is a little shepherd's hook. 
know what I'm saying? A little, a little teeny tiny hook. This is for putting on the end of the endoscope and if, say you find that jewelry, you miss it. Sk scoop, you know? So, skizzard. See, but what was this one for again? Oh, that's right, I didn't tell you. I will show you, who doesn't like? <gasps> oh, neat, it's a magnet. Ain't that just cool? Also another way to get your jewelry bags. So, you have a mirror, a magnet, and a hook. So, those are your gifts that come with one of these. Now, these vary in size. Now, this end, as you can tell, does your camera. And those little six markers around it, those are your six attached, included inside the lens, LED lights. On this end, and this looks very daunting, but I'm gonna go ahead and just pop this one off because this is neat. This is how you get the, what it says on the box here, this three in one part, okay, is because, and this is what was asked, Richard Scott's listen up, this is for you, okay? It is a kind of funny looking USB, right? So, I got this, I'm gonna turn it around. I know that's some Megatron looking USB, D. What are you talking about? Okay, this is the cool part. And you flip back the top, so like, I'll put it back in. And then, I use two fingers, it makes it like really easy. Ooh. I, I tell you guys. Okay, um, you get the point. So, it goes from USB to, what was that? Android. Magic trick. But what if you have a Samsung with a C cable device connection? What do you do? You take this extra piece that you saw earlier and you go till you hear the click, okay? In the middle or sometimes near the end of these endoscope products that I see on Wish and the ones that I bought, both of them contained this part. It has this. What's this? This is a control box that controls, obviously, the endoscope. The button here is to shutter. That's a shutter button, like a... No. Uh, it can stop start a video with the app. By the way, it does recommend buying, not buying, getting an app that helps this, you know, so you don't have to do all the device nonsense. It just automatically recognizes it. It's free. Here's the thing. It is not for iOS. You have to get it through Google or Windows. Okay. Sorry. I have it on the computer. It's nothing. It's a little video thing. It's just really basic. Very self-explanatory. Very easy to use but it's gonna be what shows you your screen on your endoscope. On your phone, there's a QR code you can scan in the instructions, and it'll take you to the app store if you have an Android. If not, your SOL. So, because you can get further with this uh, box here. The other one I bought, and I've been meaning to do this for like a month now, this video. The thing is, the first one I ordered was cruddy. It was very low quality, even though they looked almost identical in the listings. They were different sellers, same product. One was just shoddy. This thing, the control box literally just like crumbled apart in my hands. I mean, it still works, but it just poor material. So they also have now there is another little very important, mind you, very important feature on this control box. Now it's right here on the side, and I can get it with the lamp on it a little bit. It's a little dial. Do you see this? Okay. Now scrolling up or down obviously will adjust the dial. What is the dial? do this it says cool thing i will plug it into my computer because since we're plugging the computer i'm not going to take off the seat it's a little tough and it's like it looks like i struggled because i did okay this is my lip yep. so i'm going to go ahead and just plug it in by the way a app that makes you, that gives you this neat little platform called the view play cap you're going to there's on the tabs, there's file devices, options, basic, like I said. Click your devices, and you're gonna see it say USB 2.0 PC camera. When the USB is your dead giveaway, what did you just log in? That's the one. Click it, bam. And then everything now is just like so crazy because you're about to blow your mind. So, here we go. So, you may recognize someone on the screen. I'm holding this, this camera, see? It's very detailed. Now, 
Look at this. It's so dark. You can't see anything, right? It's just plain. Remember that handy dandy guy? Right there. Okay. Why don't you go ahead and crank that, baby? Why don't you give it a crank? Ooh. Yeah, that's right. See? Very bright. Very, those little tiny things. Little tiny LED lights. Fantastic. And sure enough, what was in the dark is now in the light. Here we got my table. Oh, there's color. It definitely is color. Isn't that crazy? Thank you, Richard Scotts, for recommending such a fun product. And I, you know, I recommend it. I will be leaving the information for this particular buyer and product throughout the video and at the end of the video, as well as the other shoddier yet cheaper one. And this is worth mentioning, okay? This right here. Yes. You put the brightness all the way up like it is right now. That's as bright as it goes. Pretty freaking bright. It gets hot really fast, so please be cautious, everybody. Okay, it is hot. And there are some, again, this is the granite endoscope for your Android C and USB devices. Now, don't forget, it comes with a magnet, a hook, and a mirror. So, it does work. And if that is the kind of gadget gizmo you're into, you're not gonna find it cheaper than on Wish. So, I just want, oh, by the way, um, if you're looking at me and you're thinking, does you look really, something's different, you look weird. 40, I have my lips done. So, that's what's different. So, if you or anyone you know likes to shop online, and you want somebody to try that idea out first. Hit up your girl, okay? Does he? He loves you so much, and thank you. So I'm out of here to make another video for you guys. Peace out, Boy Scout.